Pirates wore earrings to avoid being buried at sea. Here are some little known pirate facts. 1. Their earrings were not a fashion accessory. They were more akin to life insurance. The earrings were made of gold and silver. Pirates often died far from home. The earrings could be melted and sold. The money would pay for a proper burial. Earrings were given to young sailors as rewards. This marked their first crossing of the equator. 2. Earrings were also used as hearing protection. Pirates would store globs of wax in their hoops. They stuck it in their ears before firing cannons. This helped them preserve their hearing. Some pirates believed that earrings could cure seasickness. Another belief was that you couldn't drown while wearing hoops. 3. Eye patches were also worn for practical reasons. Most pirates weren't one-eyed, but many still wore patches. This way, one eye would be permanently adjusted to the darkness. This made it easier to shoot in the dark below decks. 4. Pirates rarely buried their treasure. Very rarely did pirates come upon gold or jewels. Most of what they stole was perishable. They plundered ships carrying food, alcohol, animal hides, powder, etc. It would have made zero sense to bury these items. 5. Pirates weren't exclusively male. Not only did women pirates exist, they weren't all that rare. Some tried to pass as men by cutting their hair short, but there were also famous female pirates. And Bonnie, for example, served as a first mate. 6. The Jolly Roger wasn't the only pirate flag. Pirates had plenty of different flag designs. They frequently didn't advertise themselves at all. The Jolly Roger itself had many variations. This skull and crossbones design was only one of them. Another version featured a skeleton toasting the devil. The skeleton was stabbing a human heart. But the most notorious pirate flag was blood red. It was flown to indicate the pirates would take no prisoners. 7. Pirates invented a new drink. In the 1600s, British sailors were allotted five shots of rum a day. Water was often unsafe to drink, so they mixed it with rum. Pirates borrowed the recipe for grog, added lemon juice. It helped prevent scurvy. They also added sugar for a better taste. 8. Pirates practiced their own form of gay marriage. Most pirate ships had no women on board, so same-sex relationships weren't frowned upon. This system was called matlatage. Paired-up pirate mates would share their booty. They were basically considered man and wife. 9. Pirates had their own insurance funds. Insurance payments were available to injured pirates. Individual pirate groups often had charters. They specified how much loot would be paid to injured members. All spoils were gathered together after a successful raid. Injured pirates all received the amount specified in their charter. The rest of the group divided the remainder among themselves. 10. Many pirates were upstanding members of landside society. Pirates were only lawless marauders at sea. On land, many of them were rather social-minded. William Kidd, for example, helped found Trinity Episcopal Church. He also commissioned a pew in the church specifically for his family.